Uh, hi, Stuart. Hi, Larry. Uh, you've you've often mentioned that uh, when you master this craft, you feel younger inside. Can you talk about how that impacts your external life? Well, I, you know, I've often spoke about the fact that, you know, the body gets older, you know, uh, but at the same time, you know, the chakra system in a human being can get stronger, more developed, can receive more spiritual energy, and that energy can be used in our life, you know? It's energy that most, most people function on tension. You know, how they do things every day is really just a use of their tension. And by the end of the day, most people are completely drained and they're running on empty, you know? But when the chakra system gets highly developed and really strong inside a human being, you know, we run on the overflow of our energy we sustain an inner life that really keeps us connected to spirit, that enables us to activate Kundalini. And at the same time, we can live in the world, you know, and the inner life of a human being. Get, I mean, my inner life today is probably, you know, I don't know how many years younger than it was when I was 20 years old. And I mean that. When I was 20 years old, I was running on craziness. I was running on tension, insecurity, neurosis, anxiety, you name it. Laundry list of infliction, afflictions that I had. And, you know, and today, you know, my life is run on this spiritual energy. And in order to run it that way, I have to be quieter inside, I have to be open, I have to have a highly developed chakra system. You know, so, you know, it affects the way you live. Absolutely affects the way you live. It enables me to do these classes every week. You know, I could have never done this when I was 20. First of all, I didn't have the development, the training, the knowledge, you know, the strength to be able to do this. So, you know, I mean, you know, you know, look, it's also, you know, financially, when I was younger, I used to work as a waiter, I would make, you know, $10, $12 an hour, you know, and as your system develops inside and your capacity grows inside, you know, your ability to live in the world gets more acute and to do things that generate more success in life without allowing life to devour you. Most people that are highly successful in the world are completely devoured by their success. It eats them alive. The whole secret is to get successful in life and not be devoured by it. And you can only do that if you're connected to a higher force of energy in the universe that is the source of all nourishment. And that energy allows you to function on a much higher plane in the world without there's any successes that you have in life sucking you dry. So, you know, as I say, the body gets older, well, you know what to do, but, you know, you have physical aches and pains and all that stuff, but the capacity to transcend that also increases and the capacity to do in the world also increases and to make more conscious decisions about the way you want to live your life. Thank you, Stuart. You're welcome, Larry. If you like your questions, Larry, they're very good. Thank you. Does anyone else have a question you would like to ask?
No slumber. Do you have a question? Laura? <laughs> oh, I was unmuted. Now I'm unmuted. Oh, okay. um, as we're doing this work, will we feel like a center that attracts more life yes. as we go down in our hara? Yes. Yes. I mean, the life you attract will become, you know, a much richer life, a much more conscious life. And the people that come into your world, I mean, you know, Laura, I can only talk from my own experience. When I was 25 years old, before I met, please try and sit still. When I was 25 years old, before I met my teacher, you know, I lived in an apartment in Manhattan. I was paying $38 a month rent. And my only responsibility in life was, you know, paying that rent and killing all the cockroaches in the apartment. And you know, as my capacity grew in life, you know, it, uh, it became an international life, meeting people all over the world, traveling all over the world, doing business all over the world, you know, uh, uh, teaching meditation all over the world. It is something I could have never dreamed of when I was younger. And yet here I was just doing it. And I was only doing it because I was more focused in the Hara. I was more open to spiritual energy. I was allowing that energy to guide my life. And in the process of allowing that energy to guide my life, I met so many people, interesting people all over the world. So it went from $38 a month to teaching on three, four continents, publishing books all over the, I mean, I, having my books translated into many different languages, you know, uh, having books published in India, you know, I mean, uh, Europe, I mean, I was in Norway, I think twice teaching, although I didn't know you or Skenda or Flora at that time. And I mean, it was the energy that did that. And how could I connect with that energy? I had to be grounded inside. Well, that energy would have just, just flowed right past me. Like I was a big stone, a rock in, in a river, you know? So that's what happens. You can be used by a higher force, you know, in the universe to do miraculous things with your life. And they will use you because they need people that have that kind of capacity, you know, that can do them without ego, without, as I say, becoming trapped in their success, getting swept away in their success, and that do it as a way of serving a higher force of energy in the universe. I can only talk from my own experience, what I was like when I was younger. Yes, I did travel a lot before I met my teacher, but I was running away from life. I was running away from, you know, having grounding in myself, foundation, having a spiritual life, you know, and that when I started getting grounded, it forced me to stop running away. And I started allowing the universe to guide my life that way. I mean, I just spoke to somebody, you know, just maybe 20 and a half hour ago and I, you know, wanted to know if I wanted to go to Ecuador with them, you know? I mean, this happens all the time to me, you know? So what I'm saying is that when you have that grounding, you have that centeredness, when you can be a vehicle for spiritual energy, 
it will use you in the most unbelievable ways. You know, unbelievable ways. That will I kind of felt that happen today because at work and I work in a kindergarten, I mm -hmm. noticed that the children is sitting near me uh, on my lap and they're being more calm. And in the break, I was focusing on my hara and suddenly when I opened my eyes, so many colleagues just sat around me. Well, it was like attracting life, you know? Yes, yes, that's what I, look what I've attracted here. There's people from all over the world sitting here. Norway and Brazil and all over the United States and Israel and, and you know, Belgium. I mean, that's what happens, Laura. It's because of you, because you're quieter, more centered, more open, your heart is open, you attract people, people get attracted to you. You know, I go into restaurants now and that happens. All the waiters and the cook, they all want to become friends with me, you know? I, and I don't know, you know, I, I'm just me. And, but it's that energy that is projected that really attracts that. And that to me is a very wonderful sign of your growth. You know, it's just incredible. Keep working on yourself. It'll get bigger and bigger. Thank you. You're it's welcome. wonderful to be a service to others. Yes. Both self and others. Yes, it's absolutely wonderful. It's wonderful to be used in the world that way, where you can nurture other people, give life yeah. to other people. Does anyone else have a question? Thank you. You're welcome. Laura, also thank you, because you're really starting to learn the things that I have to teach. And I'm very grateful for that. Does anyone else have a question? You would like to ask. And just to think the best part about that is it just happens organically. You know, you don't make it, it just happens. You know, these things just happen. And that really is the best part of all of that. You don't have to force it to happen, make it happen. Your energy is just of such a nature that it begins to attract. Does anyone else have a question I would like to ask? Okay, if there are no more questions, and again, thank you and bless you all. And I am so grateful to be here, to be doing this with all of you, to allowing all of you to be my teacher, what I have to do to go deep in myself, you know, in order to make this into a deeply nourishing situation. So God bless you all. Thank you. There'll be a class on what is today? What Thursday? And uh, I'm looking forward to seeing everybody. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks, everyone, asking questions. Thank you. <clears throat>